modern cavalryman's best friend is no longer the horse, but the internal combustion engine. He soon learns all about the insides of his machine and how to handle it under all sorts of adverse conditions. But although the horse has gone, there is plenty of scope for rough riding in the saddle, and the qualities of dash and daring that we expect from the cavalry corps are still fostered. There's a good deal of up and down in the troopers' training, but that's the way they like it. These lads can do anything with their machines short of winning the Grand National. In fact, they might have a shot at that too if the jockeys didn't object. They fly through the air with the greatest of ease and take to the water like ducks. First in, last out is the cavalryman's motto and for softening up operations, he likes to use that playful little toy, the tank. These monsters do the work of the old-time heavy cavalry, and one of their chief jobs is to go forward and break up the hard core of enemy resistance before an advance. A tank crew is a highly trained unit, consisting of five men. Each man is capable of doing the work of any of the others, whether as driver, gunner, or wireless operator. Driving is a tricky job, not at all like driving an ordinary car, and the men receive an intensive course of special training. You might as well be trying to stop a tank, as they say. These 340 horsepower, 40 ton heavyweights can take a 10 foot ditch in their stride and the cavalryman will let very little stand in his way when they want to go places. Their 75 millimeter gun firing armor piercing shells can hit a pinpoint target with deadly accuracy at anything up to 2,000 yards range. The range of the high explosive shells is, of course, much greater. The men of the Cavalry Corps are keenly aware of the famous cavalry exploits of Irish military history at the Yellow Ford, Ben Burb and Ballyneety, and on the battlefields of Europe after Limerick. They know that the same qualities of speed, daring and resource, together with a high degree of technical skill, are needed in the mechanized cavalry of today. They intend to live up to their proud tradition 